test, test. Okay, it's six o'clock. Thank you so much for coming today and happy Thursday to you all. Today is a much smaller group, so it's gonna be a little bit more intimate than Tuesday. Um, I will go ahead and explain to you the basics of Medicare. So feel free to stop me if you have any questions or if you think I'm going too fast, okay? My name is Thea Luzuriaga. I've been a Medicare advocate for about 16 years now. Today we will cover a guide to understanding your Medicare options. I have to say that um, you don't look like you're turning 65, but I'm sure that you're heavily bombarded by mailers, lots of phone calls, lots of marketing materials. It can be very confusing, over daunting. You don't know which direction to go to, right? So my goal is to shed some light and make things simpler and easier for you folks. Because I don't think, I've been doing this for 16 years. I've helped probably all over 10,000 seniors. I can count under my 10 fingers who really has read that Medicare handbook. Has anybody read that? That's okay. <laughs> Sometimes it gets more confusing too. Okay, so thank you for um, making the trip. I hope it was easy to come here. Like I said, my marketing manager made that mistake of giving you the general address of Furman University. So I had to have my assistant reach out to you. So sorry if you were bombarded by text messages and phone calls and emails. I wanted to make sure you didn't you know, waste your time coming here. So it's very important for me to disclose to you, I'm very compliant with the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services, that the following presentation is for general educational purposes only. Hello. No plan, no specific plan information will be discussed. I am not allowed to discuss co-pays. However, to assure you that I am licensed in about 40 states and appointed by all Medicare certified carriers in the state of North, uh, South Carolina, well, in North Carolina too. So I have no bias to whatever company. I will always do what's best for you. So again, quick introduction. My name is Thea Luzuriaga. Because I've been doing this for many, many years, I understand your language. I understand the concerns. My goal at the end of the day is really to find a plan that best fits the needs of each individual clients. A lot of you may still be employed, may want to retire, may have TRICARE, may have federal retiree benefits, may work for a small employer under 20 employees, may work for a large employer. You really don't know what to do. Are all of these concerns for you? Right, okay, so that is my goal. Um, Myself and my team, we do kind of a holistic approach to make sure that you are provided the right solution because whatever solution you decide can make a huge impact in your healthcare, both financially as well, okay? So um, here's a, let me show you my family quickly. All right, so here's my family. I've been married to my husband, Mark, for we're gonna go on 25 years in June. Um, we met each other when we were in high school in the Philippines. We have been blessed with three beautiful children. Our oldest, Marty, is not here now. He's working. He is also a licensed agent. Um, the second, our only girl, is Kira. She goes to USC and um, taking up business management and insurance risk as well, who will join the company after she graduates next year. And the young man who welcomed you is our youngest, Matthew. He's 15. So. We'll see if he'll find interest in this business as well. Um, we migrated in the United States back in 2000, and I was a stay-at-home mom. My first career, um, well, I used to sell cars in the Philippines, Toyota. When I got to the United States, my husband was working. I was a stay-at-home mom, and then I got hired by HealthNet of Connecticut. We used to live in Connecticut um, to sell Medicare plans. I knew nothing about Medicare. Uh, long story short, HealthNet was closed because it was bought by AARP United Healthcare of, of Connecticut. And so we were all laid off. And so I moved to another company called Health Plan One in 2008, 2009. And um, the owner, who is still a very 
very friend of mine has now expanded. There were only five agents then, including myself. He now has, he is one of the largest Medicare call centers in the United States. And we started with 